this. I've got some rockets. Gregory Shugwa. How the hell do I fire them? Um, I, I forgot oh. the tutorial. It's... War Thunder, a game where you fly around in planes and shoot shit, even though that is not the actual game itself. There, This is in closed beta, of course. Uh, as many of you may be aware, a lot of YouTubers are actually playing this at the moment. Um, and I can tell you, it's absolutely brilliant fun. It is free to play at the moment. I'll put a link in the description below so you can go check it out, download it if your PC is actually capable of running this damn thing. Um, Basically, what War Thunder is, it is a hell of a lot of fun. That is what it is. Basically, you fly around in planes at the moment, because it's in Bayer, obviously. It's only the aerial side of things. But, um, yeah. Basically, you fly around in planes and shoot stuff. And you can buy other planes with yes. in-game currency, which is done by microtransactions, funnily enough. And you can earn and unlock planes. <laughs> I mean, what I'm flying in the moment is the Hawker Hurricane Mark Ooh, which I've got a lot of rockets on, and I'm devastating yeah, ground units, uh, aerial targets. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm I'm okay with, but uh, ground targets are my main thing, and, and landing. I'm good at landing. I'm very good at landing actually. Um, yeah, apart from that, I'm pretty much terrible. But my impressions on this game. Um, there's one major flaw with it at the moment, which I can see is the camera. The camera is absolutely terrible. Um, if you try go up. <laughs> Basically, you can only see the underneath of your aircraft, which is ridiculous. I feel that the camera should be placed behind it so that you can actually see where the hell you're going. Um, possibly <laughs> even even if you're in cockpit view, it's hard to see where you're going in this game. I don't know why, but I know for a fact that this game is actually based off a game that I used to absolutely love, which is called I Will Two Storm of Birds of Prey on PS3. Oh, I love that game so much. Um... Obviously, Birds of Prey was a lot better than War Thunder because War Thunder is free and Birds of Prey you actually had to pay about £40 for. But it is absolutely my most favourite game ever. But, yeah. Um, <laughs> but War Thunder is basically based off that because they've ripped half the music, the maps, and half the aircraft from it. So, um, I, I kind of, as soon as I got in, in the game, I kind of, you know, I automatically assumed that it was basically... That they approach oh, yeah. IL2 Stumovic. I can't remember what the name of the company that makes IL2 Stumovic is, but they basically approach them and ask if they could make a game. I, that's my first impressions. But um, this is a very, very good uh, competitor for World of Tanks. Even though it's planes, uh, there's going to be a tank side of it and a ship side of it. Um, I'm really looking forward to those. Uh, ship side, definitely. I'm going to be uh, having I fun was, uh, with battleships. But um, there's two type of game modes, well, three technically, but two types of game modes that are actually relevant at the moment, which is arcade mode, which is kind of like a first person shooter type style, where you fly around in planes with the mouse and shoot stuff down, sort of. And the other one is historical battle mode, which is basically the uber realistic version where you can be flying for about 10 to 15 minutes just to get to the actual battle, which is obviously what you do in real life. So, um,. It is a pretty, pretty awesome game. I really recommend you guys get uh, This isn't the yes. first starter planes you get. Originally, if you uh, start out, you get three biplanes, if I'm correct, which are absolutely terrible. I hate them. They're the most agile thing in the world, but they have terrible armor and terrible armament. So, yeah, I would rank up as quick as you can. I mean, the Hawker Hurricane, it's good armament, good armor, but it's slow it's and the enemy air base. so, so bad at turning. It is the most worst plane ever for turning. But it's good for ground units, as you can see in this video. But um, I, I really, really am enjoying this game. I'm, I'm going to probably intend on unlocking more aircraft so I can show you a bit more of this, because I absolutely love this game. I want to be showing you more of this, see what uh, we get up to in this there's quite a few different game modes as well as Domination, there's Ground War. Domination is basically where you have to land on an airfield and capture it, which is quite awesome. I like that. That's that's the kind of thing I like because it takes some skill trying to land. Um, and then you've got Ground War, which is what we're playing here. We have to destroy all the on-ground targets and then your unit side kind of wins the game. But there's like uh, there's a few things wrong with it. Like, for instance, you can see that I've actually painted my plane with shark teeth on the front, which is freaking awesome. I love my shark teeth. But, um, that's, that's basically War Thunder, really. It's, pl it's flying around in planes, 
having a hell of a lot of fun. And, um, you know what? I am going to do a lot of this in the future. I really recommend you guys check out check the link in the description below. Go to that page, download it, and I will see you on the battlefield. I'll see you next time, guys. Peace off.